we start with one hour chart just i want to give you a quick update if we refer to our analysis if we mentioned for long term we're looking for buy that's mean if we get the reversal we can look for buy but as you can see there was no reversal and beside that we mentioned the price can consolidate here for longer time okay and right now this is what we get and in re we can put this one as a correction relative to this for one more drop and if we get the drop any drop with the breakout of this low we can expect the price to drop to around 17 because the lowest price is 16 that's mean almost near to the previous low if we put over fib based on 27 percent all right but even if the price drop from here, technically we cannot look for trade unless we put our entry below this, which is I won't suggest it because the reasons we do the analysis, we want to look for the sell setup. If anyone wants to look for sell, I prefer wait for one move up if the price couldn't break this one. We see the flag. As we can see, we have an internal correction. Then for move up, then any trade from there, we can look for sell. Okay, it doesn't mean the price cannot drop from here. Even can, and as I mentioned, even the drop as a sharp move, we can expect the price to drop to 17. But the question is how we can look for trade. Anyway, for long term, we're looking for buy. And any buy from now, we will take it. Because mostly if the price break, the previous low, which is around, exact value will be around 20. If the, we see the breakout of the 20 and we refer to the indicators, we see we have a divergence. And the best thing is we see one more drop. We confirm this correction is finished in relative to this. Then any reversal from there, we will take the trade. Okay. And if the price drop and break this low, having entry above this can be an option. It depends how deep it can go. But if the price drop and retest the previous low or drop to the 70, having entry above this is not valid. We any drop with the breakout of the 20, we try to put our entry above this in case the price sharply reverse. Then from there, if there is any update, I will share. But to look for trade, as I mentioned, the best thing is we can confirm this correction is all finished. Then any reversal from there, we can look for buy. But how about if the price reverse from here? Also, we look for buy. If we get any reversal with a sharp move, like we will take the trade. That means we don't need to wait for the confirmation of this correction. But the best thing is we wait, we get one more drop, okay? Anyway, for long term, we're looking for buy. And right now, we don't have any trade setup to look for trade. And even based on daily chart, as what we expected, we mentioned, we can expect the price to consolidate here and drop some more. And if I move to forward chart, even based on forward chart, we see this correction. That's why I prefer to get one more drop with the breakout of the 20, then from there, if we look for reversal, why we cannot buy within this one, we have to get the trade set up. How about if this one, as we mentioned, if you put over FIB from here, if we can follow the 27%, we'll be around the 17. Because the next down move, if it turns to a sharp move, even the price can retest the previous low. Okay, anyway, we're just looking, we don't have any trade set up, but Mostly we're looking for a reversal, but the only thing is we need to conform with this correction, as I mentioned. In this case, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.